Hey guys, what's up? Happy Sunday. You're welcome to another weekly vlog. If you're seeing me for the very first time, my name is Akusia, Akusia Benhene. If you're a returning subscriber, hey boo, hey boo, what do you do? So it's a new week. Um, it's actually Sunday. Sunday doesn't feel like a new week, even though it is a new week. I just finished creating some content. We have blonde hair. Who's this girl? <laughs> this girl I'm gonna take this off like today cuz this is a lot for me I'm not gonna lie like I feel like this type of blonde is too much for me I would definitely do platinum type of blonde or maybe some highlights here and there but this is giving baby it's giving yellow blonde and it's not like my vibe plus it's too much in the front so I'm definitely gonna have this re-dyed um, but I had to like create content with it and you know feel the feeling when you have blonde hair on because i've never had blonde hair on and a lot of the girls are like blonde girls then they you know that they, they say something blonde hair don't care so they just say i don't really know but apparently when you have blonde hair on it makes you feel like a bad bitch even though it kind of makes me feel like that okay <laughs> anyway it's sunday i finished creating content it's currently 11 38 can you imagine i've created um two pieces of content actually three interesting i'm about to make something for us to eat from i just woke up daddy's bringing her downstairs um but yeah i just wanted to start off the vlog and you know open up the week say you're welcome i hope that you enjoy and yeah let me tidy up my kitchen it's looking crazy <laughs> and then let me do what i have to do for the rest of the day it's looking it's looking like a good day already but yeah you're welcome okay and this is today's makeup today's look i have it on my instagram this look is actually popping okay i did my routine i've been playing around with my makeup and i really like how i've been playing around with my makeup i've been doing like different types and styles of placement if i'm saying it right so yeah i've been placing products differently and i like you know the outcome every time it's always like it's always a hit okay because look at that skin look and then also look at my eyeshadow she's so beautiful it's always so like spontaneous but then it always comes out looking good so i have a tutorial for this look on my instagram i'm sure it's already up so be sure to follow me on instagram if you don't already do that because if you don't i don't know what you're doing but follow me on instagram to check out the tutorial and i think i have a short on here as well and on tiktok so the girl is everywhere. Yeah. <laughs>
catch a break Give a pretty brown girl her space You can keep your bitter I'ma make a better way Cause I've been working all day Can a nigga catch a break So we're having some pizza for dinner So yes I have some Alfredo pizza If you've never had that try it If you ever see it on the menu try it because it's so good It's some Alfredo pizza but yes that's the first time that I'm having chicken in a long time, so I don't know. I don't know how I feel, but whatever. The end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up. All I want is to go again, but you ain't picking your phone up. Why you messing my head up? Any night, any day, let me take you away. All I need is just saying, yeah, 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 yeah. Better nights, better days. When you're here with me, babe, cause you're all that I crave. Hey guys, good morning. Happy Monday. I'm so hungry. Let me just say that. <laughs> I am so hungry. So it's Monday morning. I am currently at work. It's 11.49. So I'm still at work. But I'm hungry. I'm fasting today. Um, this week is my fasting week. I I'm detoxing myself basically bringing myself back on track when it comes to my fitness because I've been slacking I haven't worked out for like a whole week I think the whole of last week I didn't really work out and you know besides that I feel like my mind is not in a good place for working out because I haven't even pushed myself to like wake up on time and go along with my routine and all of that and whenever I feel like that, I know something is wrong, you know, <laughs> something is wrong. So I have to put myself back on track. So that's what I'm doing to get back on track with my fitness and everything. Um, but yeah, I'm going to grab me some Chobani from the fridge and just eat that to like close. I have an hour more to go. So I feel like a yogurt should do me good. And my fast day is ending at 12. It's currently 11.50, so I have 10 more minutes, but I'm just gonna let that 10 minutes go. I'm gonna eat a yogurt, I can't do it. I'm talking to a lot of customers today. Like, you guys know I work in customer service, so I'm always on the phone. And it's just so busy today that I need something in my stomach. Like, I need something in my belly, cause I'm cranky for nothing. I'm literally acting like a cranky little child. But I'm cranky, I know, I have my days when things are not going my way, I'm just cranky for nothing. But I'm gonna grab a yoga and go and sit back down. I wanted to open up the vlog, I think I did that yesterday. Hmm, I think I did, what am I talking about? Anyway, happy Monday. Duh. <laughs> So I have my Chobani. I want to show you guys a little trick that my husband and I, we have been doing. If you don't have any granola, you can use this Nature's Valley oatmeal situation. It's just like biscuits. So what we usually do is that we like to crush the biscuits, right? And then you're just gonna... Oh, not me making a mess. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry and then you just put it inside but not all of it because all of it is too much for this little jar of yoga so I usually do about like half and just like that I have my chobani and oatmeal <laughs> okay so this is what it looks like literally nothing <laughs> but it's also really nice and filling and it's healthy um so in the business of what i eat in a day when i'm fasting this is my first meal of the day this is usually kind of like my first meal of the day i'm not gonna lie when i'm fasting because i like to go easy so i usually would do like a smoothie or maybe when i'm in the mood i would just go ham i'm not gonna lie but for today this is the first meal of the day i'm just gonna sit back down 
go do my job and then when I close I will see you guys okay work is over over <laughs> I have clothes from work I'm happy because I'm about to eat <laughs> I am about to eat and I'm so excited I'm about to eat my first proper meal um, besides the yogurt that I had so I already meal prepped last night I'm sure you guys so like a little bit of that i did some rice i did some beans honestly confession remember the food that i ordered last week you guys when i ordered the mexican burrito bowl oh my god that stuff is so good mm. oh that stuff was so good like i that's literally the one order that i've done that i still feel like yep i don't regret spending my money on that because it was so good now i liked it so much that i decided to remake it <laughs> so i meal prepped literally the same thing and i kept it in the fridge i have my shrimp you guys saw i chopped up some veggies and then i cooked some rice and then i have some beans so literally the same thing however i don't think I, that's what i'm gonna be having right now because also last night i cooked some goat's meat stew i cooked some goat meat stew and you know i have that which is still out here you know so i'm thinking we'll finish that you know wasting food in this household so <laughs> i'm gonna eat that and plus i like goat meat i'm not gonna lie i think it'll be good so i'm gonna heat up some rice and some goat meat i actually kind of want to fry some plantain on the side so i'm gonna do that and then just have that for lunch it's 1 30 and then i'm gonna go to edit i have to edit the things on my to-do list i had a content that i had to deliver today so i've done that i'm waiting to hear back from them um but i have to edit i have to also do my driver's exams i know my learner's permit exams i still haven't done it i will do that by the end of today and then i have a huge load of laundry so what i'm trying to do is one day out of the whole week I'm going to be doing one thing <laughs> and when I say one thing I mean like folding the laundry and stuff like that and the laundry that I have is not like create like small laundry it's crazy <laughs> just like laundry from like three weeks <gasps> and don't even judge me <laughs> okay that's the one thing the one thing that I still haven't like worked around the folding laundry I just find it too much work for me I hate it like I feel like every clothes I would love to hang all my clothes but I don't have the space to do that and I have to fold some and put them in my drawers and those ones I hate them the ones that I have to hang quick and easy <laughs> I would in the future I want to hang all my clothes I don't want to fold nothing maybe like some gym stuff I don't mind keeping them in my drawers but certainly don't like folding stuff no I'm not a fan <laughs> but anyway oh the hair that I installed yesterday I added some edges, remember? This is what the edges look like. It's not so bad. I woke up this morning and I'm like, okay, it's not so bad. And it's not crazy. You know, it's not giving crazy edges, so. But this is what the hair looks like. Yesterday I had it in the middle part. Today I woke up and then I felt like I wanted it in the side part. I don't know. But it's just temporary hair anyway. It's really short. I don't know. I feel like I can do so much with it, so it's not so much fun. And I feel like I'm also still getting used to it because it's so small but i am trying to go and get my hair done somewhere this week or next week i'm still deciding where i want to go to the lady that did my cornrows she's good i told you guys she does everything but she doesn't seem to have availability i'm not even gonna lie let me tell you guys okay i'm not even going to i'm not even going to try to hide anything <laughs> i'm not even going to try to mince my words i feel like and it's not like me trying to put her on blast like i feel like her communication is not entirely how i like communication <laughs> i'm i'm big on communication okay and when it comes to hair when you text her sometimes i would text her she would read the message and she would not reply and then i'm thinking i don't know you know I'm, i don't know what to think because you know i try to like give a lot of excuses in that scenario i'm like oh, okay she's in school she's busy she has a child she will get back to me but sometimes she never does 100 percent of the times actually she never does <laughs> and i have had to like text her back a few times to check to see you know just because i'm that type of person i will 
check you know to see what's going on I've only met you one time so I want to know if it's just because you're busy or if you don't want to do my hair I mean I know my hair is short and like a little problematic but you know I just want to know what's going on but every time that I've texted or every time that I've like you know sent some hair idea you know the vibe that I'm expecting to get I don't get or I don't get an immediate reply or you know I get the red left on red situation and I'm like uh, you're a business I'm a client I expect to be replied to <laughs> you know like I expect you to get back to me and on time you know so I feel like maybe she doesn't have time for the hair right now because she also mentioned that she's in school so it makes sense she might be too busy with school um, and not having enough time for appointments which makes perfect sense again this hair that I'm gonna do it's like I was saying so this hair that I'm gonna go do I am um, like I want to like I want to I want it to come out perfect okay it's not even about perfection but it's like I, I'm paying for it if you get what I'm saying like I'm ready to pay for it so I want it to be done well I don't want any skirmishes type of job so I want to go to someone who's ready to do my hair who's excited as I am um, you know so I definitely I think I'm gonna go with someone else I'm not even gonna lie and that's just because I want my money to give me the results that I'm looking for and you know I also want it to be you, you get what I'm saying you know, I'm paying for it so I decide where I want my money to go to so I will book somebody else that's just what I'm trying to say but when I do I will let you guys know I'm still looking googling to see if I can find someone um, you know but in the meantime we're gonna have this hair on and figure out what I am gonna do with my hair situation let me make my plantains, let me eat, let me edit and do what I have to do and I will see you guys when I have to, okay? So I have a few things from Amazon that I want to unbox with you guys, so let's get into that. It's currently 7.44. I am in the process of making dinner, so yeah. I'm not actually making dinner per se, I'm honestly prepping food for daycare tomorrow. I'm making some mashed potatoes from a puff day here and then I'm also just prepping some stew the goat meat stew that we had it's left with like small we have just a little piece left like just small so I have to make another one <laughs> I can't even find the words to describe it but I'm making another one but in the meantime I have a few things from Amazon so let's get into unboxing that and see I do know what I have I just want to you know show you I ordered some new shampoo because I ran oh, I hope I didn't break the shampoo not me cutting the thing with an actual knife like why am I doing that I ran out of the shampoo that I have and use and I decided to get another one um, I decided to get this one from head and shoulders so head and shoulders actually has products for dandruff so if you're dealing with dandruff I've used them in the past and it was actually good for my scalp so if you deal with dandruff or you deal with itchy scalp flaky scalp you should definitely look into this brand they're really good okay so this is just for my actual hair so the last few things that I have or the last two things that I have are from Olaplex I'm actually very excited um, this is the first time that I'm trying anything from this brand I got their number three um, this is their hair mask it's their number three hair perfector um, I think I've had a few girls talk about this before it's supposed to be a repairing hair treatment and you know Olaplex has the name so this is the first time that I'm gonna be trying it out to see what it gives to see you know the vibes that it's gonna give I want to treat my hair before I get it done so I decided to get that and then I also got the bonding oil the very very popular bonding oil let me Take it out and show you this one right here you guys have seen this I'm sure it's supposed to be a heat protecting oil but also supposed to you know moisturize the hair the whole nine yards I bought it mainly for giving your hair volume and then also protecting the hair from heat so so that's it for um, that's pretty much everything that I have from Amazon for delivery um, I'm just wrapping up 
with cooking I'm not really hungry I'm not gonna lie um, but yeah I'm gonna just wrap up the things that I have to do take my shower I'll probably take off the wig I'm not gonna lie <laughs> I'll probably take it off just because I want my hair to rest before I go and do my actual hair appointment so I want to like you know let my actual hair rest I want to wash it I want to condition it the whole nine years before I go so yeah I think I will take it out and let my hair rest for a little and then um, yeah I'm rumbling I'm just talking what I'm thinking <laughs> but if you guys don't see me again today I'm sure I'll see you tomorrow because tomorrow's day can run and I don't want to overwhelm myself tonight I want to make sure that everything is like ready and good to go and then I need her to also sleep so yeah can you imagine <laughs> Imagine talking about daycare is closed tomorrow because there's there's um apparently there's a storm coming this way there's a snowstorm coming this way and because of that daycare is closed just to inform you that due to the weather and as our policies are guided by instructions of Delhi schools tomorrow we will be closed February 13th <laughs> Okay, look at that. Daycare is closed for tomorrow. So no daycare run tomorrow. I am not mad at that. Cause yeah, we do have a snowstorm coming out here tomorrow. I mean, there is a predicted snowstorm. We don't know if it's gonna happen, but there is a predicted snowstorm coming into this area. So because of that, schools are closed. So she's not going to school tomorrow, so. It took care of itself. I don't have to bother myself. Um, I will just go along my day as per usual. It's good that I prepped some food for her anyway. So she has that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go chill for the rest of the night. Oh, can you guys believe the content that I sent out? I have to... I don't have to redo it per se. I just have to do a voiceover for the content. I don't think they wanted to hear my voice. But it looks like they want to. So voiceover it is. Um... But yeah, <laughs> that is it for today. I will see you guys tomorrow. Honestly, I will see you guys tomorrow. Hi friends, happy Friday. Um, happy Friday. So my hair is dead, okay. Yesterday, I sort of like checked in with you guys. Not so much, but I, you know, showed you a thing or two when I had to go and do my hair. Um, I did a new install. This is a sew in with a closure. I will show you guys. I'm still getting used to it. I'm not gonna lie. But this is the hair that I said I wanted to go and do. I've done it, okay? Um, but I will show you when I'm going out. <laughs> right now I'm about to unbox stuff, so yeah. But it's Friday. I hope you're having a good day. I am out of work right now. I'm vlogging with my phone. I was literally looking for it. But let me show you. I have... So... <clears throat> We have a few. Oh, let me not put the box here. But you saw that. So I have a few new things from Amazon that I want to unbox with you guys. I have something that's actually very exciting, and I wanted to show you. I'm not gonna lie. It's not even about the unboxing. There's just something that's really exciting in here that I need to show you. So let us see. Let's see. <laughs> I'm so happy. But let me just say that I'm so tired. I don't have the energy. I don't even have the energy. My energy is like zero. Yesterday I came back from the salon at almost 10 p.m. <sighs> I was so tired, okay? The first few things that I have are skincare or body care stuff. I am trying some products from Naturium. I haven't tried anything from Naturium. I'm not gonna lie. The girls have been talking about it. And also mostly because the girls have been talking about how affordable it is, but still gets the job done. And if you know me, 
I like good stuff. I like good quality products. But I also like people who think about the world that we're in right now. People who are being reasonable, which is entrepreneurs who knows that things are hard. So let me do quality stuff, but still give it to people who, you know, can afford it. Or you, I mean, like, yeah, I don't mind splurging on a thing or two every now and then. But I like me a good affordable skincare, body care, stuff like that. I feel like they shouldn't be crazy. Okay, so this stuff, I'm excited to try it out. I have their um, Glow Getter. So this is a Glow Getter Multi Oil Body Wash. It's supposed to be an oil to gel formula that intensely moisturizes. So it's a body wash. That's why I got it. Um, and apparently it's moisturizing as well. So we'll try it out. We'll see what it says. And then I also got a moisturizer to go with it. I have the Biolipid moisturizer i actually watched a whole amazon review on this one there was a lady that was saying she did a whole video talking about how deeply moisturizing it is and if you have dry skin how beneficial this would be to you because again my my skin is such like i'm sure people have the same thing my face is like very oily combination you guys can see how my nose is shiny if i don't moisturize my legs they're dry and cracking as hell <laughs> so i don't know what balance is going on here but i need like rich moistures for my body and then i need water-based stuff for my face <laughs> so yeah so i think i would like this and the moisturizer that i have right now is almost out so i think this is coming at a good time so we'll try it out and then we'll let you know okay hold on let me drink some water because i'm thirsty before i get into my new I got a robot's vacuum so that you don't have to or so that you get it too and that's so exciting because you know if it doesn't work for me you would hear from me if it's not good you hear from me okay this is honestly a matter of convenience for me as a mom cleaning this house you know like keeping the house tidy in general is something that I love to do like I love to see my house look clean I love to see my space look tidy but the reality of things is because of my job and because i have i have a kid and everything i have kids okay it's always not going to be spick and span how i want it to be you know what i'm saying so with that being said i am trying to find things that are like convenient things that will help me reduce the amount of workload that i put on myself honestly sometimes my husband is just looking at me and he's like why don't you just relax because you don't really have to clean every other day <laughs> and i'm like well i want to do it <laughs> i got a robot vacuum robot vacuum cleaner i have been wanting one of these for the longest time i'm not even going to lie and i just didn't want to get any raggedy robots vacuum cleaner so i went all out okay <laughs> i'm not even gonna lie i got a good one and again i will let you guys know if it doesn't go well and what i mean it doesn't go well if it's like messing up within two weeks i will let you know nobody knows me like you it's okay i will do it i promise no singing and dancing today <laughs> okay let's see what she looks like enough 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 so exciting so this is the robot vacuum this is what she looks like she's actually bigger than i thought i honestly thought she'll always be like some small little thing walking around even though she's little she's not so little and it pairs with wi-fi i love that i, I think i did know that it paired with wi-fi i'm so excited if, if you can't tell let me just let you know i am so excited this is going to be cleaning around doing my like weekday cleaning for me and then over the weekend i will just pull out my big boy vacuum and then zoom, 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 clean the house that's how i like it so this is for weekday quick clean oh let's see what she looks like so it comes with it comes with a remote you have a remote to control that right you have some batteries 
you have the charging um this is like the charging dock yeah this is literally the charging dock so when it's done cleaning it will just go and dock itself onto this and then charge it so that's always nice and you have the charger for the charging dock situation what is that you have some three little some things take out stuff i don't know what this is but i'll keep it and i'll figure it out later and then you have some brush that you can use to clean it i think yeah like two of those and then you have this small brush that you can use to like you know clean the vents and the filters and stuff so that's nice so i am going to try to set this up really quickly and then i'll show you guys what it does okay so it comes with it's so let me just state that it's a two-in-one it's a vacuum robots vacuum and also a mop so it will clean and then mop the area so okay <laughs> i love it this is an up close of what it looks like i hope that's a good enough view your girl is tired so i've got to sit my ass down okay i'm exhausted but she's beautiful oh i'm so happy that i got this i am so happy i'm so happy i'm happy let me set it up i'll come back and show you guys what it looks like okay but we got a robot vacuum these are come some of the things that excite you when you're an adult this this cleaning the house something to do that love it <laughs> you guys this is what it looks like I put water inside so maybe it might because I don't want it to mop so let me put it off for right now <laughs> hey guys um, I'm about to do some skincare this is actually like my maintenance routine sort of skincare my I have to shave my face it's something that I do every month so I'm just gonna do that and then I'm gonna go to bed I usually like to do that on dry skin. Let's just get this skincare going, okay? I haven't done that in a while, so I'm just gonna. Oh, I can actually feel. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you may see that. That's the peach fuzz. So I usually like to do this on dry skin. I feel like so it works a lot, lot better for me. Everybody has like their own preference, but on dry skin, it works like magic for me. You always want to pull the skin taut, and then you can go ahead and shave that dead skin. Um, you know, shave the face. It shaves the peach fuzz, dead skin cells, and all of that. Look at how much hair is. Oh my god. The peach fuzz is crazy. Okay, so I'm done with the face pretty much. It's actually a very quick process. And then I'm gonna do the brows. Oh, this blade is nice and sharp. Like, can you see my brows? Like, it's clean within a second. Okay, look at that brow. Oh, oh, I did my brow so good. Oh, you guys see that? That is such a good brow. Yeah, but I think I have the structure going for both of them, so 
don't like that. So, oh, my face looks like really sh clean. You can see my face is shaved and like fresh. Anyway, I'm about to do, I love this stuff, to get the gunk around my nose area. I will leave a link on Amazon, but also if you go into Walgreens, just pretty much any beauty store, they might carry that because it's quite popular. You have to put some water on your nose before you can actually use it. This is the brand, just in case, just in case you wanted to check it out, that's the brand. But it's a charcoal nose cleansing mask and it works like magic. Like I should have brought it a little down. But she's stuck. <laughs> so she's not gonna go anywhere. But my most important part is like the sides of my nose. I feel like it collects, it definitely collects like a lot of stuff that we probably might not be looking at. <laughs> it looks so weird. <laughs> but it gets the job done. Trust me, it does. It works like magic. I'm gonna use some mask from Aceology. This is a green tea mask. I don't know. I think I've used it one time with you guys before. Um, but it's really nice. It's such a cooling. Oh, it's so cold. Oh, it's so cold. And because I just shaved my face, it's the perfect time to put on some mask. I usually would like cleanse my face before. I actually should have done that, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> now that I'm thinking about it, I should have done that. Cleanse and tone my skin before using the mask. It's, it's alright. It's a hydration mask. So it's not bad. I have the mask on. I'm gonna go sit down for like 10 to 15 minutes. Actually, it says, oh, okay, 20 to 30 minutes. That's a long time. <laughs> I guess I'll be coming back in 20 to 30 minutes, but yeah, I'm just gonna leave this on for a while. Okay, guys, so it's time to take it off. Oh, okay. Can you guys see that? You see the little like white stuff? It's like really tiny, tiny white stuff. And that's like... I pulled it out of my nose area. And I usually just like to like... I don't know if you guys do that, but... I do it every now and then. <laughs> oh. Using some toner. I'm gonna keep it really simple tonight because <laughs> I'm tired. I might have to go to bed. I'm using my Dermatica treatment. I think it's doing a good job, I'm not gonna lie. I'll give you guys an update in next week's vlog. But so far, my skin. It's, you know, she's still normal, but, you know, it hasn't reacted, so that's what I'm trying to say. I'm going to use some eye cream. I don't think when you're going to bed, that's the best time that you get your impact with your skincare. I always go overboard with my eye cream, so it's whatever. And then I'm using this moisturizer from the Inky List. And then I'm gonna top it up with this oil from Sweet July Skin. I think I unboxed this in last week's vlog. I'm not so sure. But if I didn't, yes. Uh, this is the brand that I was working with. 
in last week's vlog or in this week's vlog or in last week's vlog i think yeah this can feel so good and then i'm gonna use this lip smoothie from um pharmacy Okay, skin is glowing. Okay, you guys, so that's pretty much everything for my little facial maintenance routine. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I feel good. But on this note, I'm gonna have to end off the weekly vlog right here. Thank you guys so much for watching this week's vlog. Okay, let me know if you like it. I will leave a link for my Amazon storefront as per usual in the description box. <laughs> But it's Saturday night, I'm gonna go to bed and, you know, edit the vlog, do what I have to do, and then tomorrow's content creation as per usual. Thank you guys so much for watching, I will see you guys in next week's vlog. Bye! When they say she get it from her mama, mama say you fuck her right, body booty is bumping like a dummy in the hall, but come tell me is you down, cause I'm trying to go good tonight, all the hoochies left and right.